today we're reviewing a set of Red Dragon darts. It's the Amberjack Pro One. These are 22 gram steel tip. So let's see how well these throw. So first we'll check the packaging, check the darts, then have a few throws at the board. Okay, so I'm not going to go much in details with this. It's your just your generic standard uh, packaging from Red Dragon. It's got 22 grams there. I can picture the top three players from Red Dragon on this. Again, it comes in your foam packaging but what we really want to look at is the dart itself we'll have a little bit of a closer look at the dart so it's got black tip point it's got this black pvd coating all the way along this barrel here as well it's got a slight rounded nose and an open radial groove cut to these as you can see there's two radial cuts in there with the orange paint on each side of the band and you can see on that band it's got the rt for red dragon then again, it goes into that black radial groove cut there before it goes to the vector short stems and the black and orange hardcore thick flights. So the length of this is 50.8 millimeters and the width is 6.35 millimeters. These come in 22 grams, 24 grams, 26 grams, and you do get soft tip version, which is 20 grams as well. There is a Pro 2 version if you're not suited to this, which is a different style of barrel, so you can look at that as well. The grip on this, that section there, I'd probably give it a 3. On that back section, because you've got that um, slight band to it as well, it's not got much of a grip, so I'll give that a 2.5. Um, so if you're like me, you hold this section you may find that a little bit slippy, but we'll find out anyway. Okay, so the darts are fully set up. Um, the grip, yeah, I still still agree that this front section here and the open radial cut is uh, got the best grip to it. Not so much at this back section here because that band, I think, kind of ruins it. If they just made that all the way up, it would have been perfect. But we'll see how we get on. Game on. Oh, oh the hundred. I still feel that there's a lot bit of slippage there at the back. Uh, but yeah, look good on the board. Not a bad balance to these as well. Ah, oh, 41. Oh, don't know where that was going. <laughs> that was a squeeze jiff with the hand there. 92, right, I'm going to leave it that. Let's do a little summary. Okay, so the Red Dragon, the Amberjack Pro 1s. Not a bad set of darts, actually. I, I thought they were going okay. Um, not great. I think there's just not enough grip there for me as a rear gripper kind of guy. Uh, I think the band, I just wish your brands would just think about the, bar the band and just make the whole barrel useful for dark players. Put the band up near the stem area, please, guys. Um, I think that just ruined it for me. I think if they had this here at this back here and just put a couple of the orange paint rings on it, it would have been perfect. I would have threw really comfortable and I wouldn't have doubts about the grip on this. But yeah, just... Guys, think about this section here, eh? Just, that's where we like to put the thumbs. But apart from that, it's a not bad. It was good balance to it. The colours are really well. That black PVD cone doesn't take away from the grip at all. And it's £30 as well for these. If You know, it's cheap. And it, there are great barrels to throw with as well. So if you're starting up darts so or you just want a, a, a cheaper set, 
definitely have a look at these. I'll leave a link in the description box where you can purchase these. Do check out Red Dragon's other products as well. There's some fantastic darts out there. So do have a look at them. Just like to thank Red Dragon for sending these out to me to review on their behalf. So thank you to you guys. And that's it for me. Hope you liked the video. Don't forget to click that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so. Turn your notifications for any new reviews and live streams. And I'll catch you in the next one. Happy dark guys. Bye.